Yo guys, what's up? King Luke here. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to boost FPS and reduce your opinion lag in Fortnite Mobile in Chapter 2 Season 2 and with the new Chaos Engine. Uh, thanks for the support on the last video, it did really good. And, and I'm almost close to 2,000 subs, so because of that, I'm going to be doing a giveaway uh, for a $10 iTunes or Play Store gift card. So if you don't have the Battle Pass, you can buy it with that. Uh, there will be a link in the description to enter with all of the rules. Um, if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, uh, leave a like on the video. Your post notifications and use my credit code King Luke and Amshop. And if you want to get a shout out, send a picture of you using that code to my Twitter. Link in the description for a shout out of your choice on your social media. So yeah, thank you guys for watching and let's get into the video. Okay, so once you guys have opened settings, go to Apple ID at the top, go to iCloud, scroll down, enter iCloud drive off, then go back out into iTunes and App Store. Make sure all these are turned off at the top here. You don't want anything around the background. And go back out. Go down to Bluetooth, turn off Bluetooth, go into notifications, and turn on never, and nothing pops up in the game. Let's go down to general. Make sure your software is updated to the latest point, like I have here. Make sure everything runs smooth. Go down to background app refresh, make sure this is turned off so nothing is updated in the background, only Fortnite is. And go back out, go to accessibility, motion, and turn on reduce motion. This helps just make sure stuff runs smoothly and you don't need anything unnecessary running. Then go down to wallpaper. Um, choose a new wallpaper. Make sure it is a still. Keep on stills. You can choose any one of these. My favorite is just a regular one like this. So set this for both. Now go down to battery. Make sure low power mode is turned off. This way Fortnite doesn't have to use a low settings to run the game. And lastly, go into privacy, location services, turn location services off. I don't want to turn them off though because I'm just using it for this purpose of the video. But if you're playing Fortnite, turn them off. You don't need those on. And that's it for your settings. You do not need anything else in here turned off. So um, I'll get into the app now you guys want to use for helping your FPS. The app you're going to want to get is called Smart Cleaner. Or if it is not free, which it currently is free on the App Store, you can download a device cleaner. Just look at the device cleaner on the App Store. And basically what this app does is it cleans all of the duplicate storage and photos and apps um, in your device. So if you have like two photos of the exact same, it will get rid of them and you don't need them anymore. It does not get rid of any personal stuff and only if it's duplicate it will get rid of. And I don't have that much duplicates here because I have already done this um, multiple times and it just cleans stuff and makes run stuff smoother. And now I'll show you guys some Fortnite okay, stuff. So once you have Fortnite opened, go into settings and you will see auto set quality quality presets turn that all the way down to low low makes it so it doesn't have to worry about like graphics being high and taking up most of the stuff that needs to run the game lowest will help and then three resolution turn that on to about 70 60 to 70 is the best i have found out and then turn on show fps off these are the fortnite settings that you can do for mobile and uh, yeah if you guys want to see how they work just turn show fps back on and see how much it helped and uh, yeah that's all the settings Thank you guys for watching this video. If you're new, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And fill out the giveaway link below in the description for a chance to win the $10 gift card. And if you use my credit code, Kim Luke in the Am Shop, and send a picture to my Twitter, link in the description, I will give you a shout out of your social media choice. And yeah, thank you guys for watching, and have a good rest of the day.